Imagine if we took Dottie's DNA and cloned her. It would have been impossible in California, considering their fish and wildlife is just a bunch of crayon eating dips. But had Dottie lived in Texas, she would have been taken to a laboratory where they breed genetic super bass. In 1986, Texas started the Sherlunker program, where any fish caught over 13 pounds is then taken by the state and transported to a facility where big bass breed with big bass. The idea actually stems from horse racing, where winning horses are bred and their lineage long outlives them. The Sherlunker program is doing the same thing. Offspring with dominant genetics are stocked throughout the state, resulting in bass that grow bigger and faster. And it's been highly successful through DNA testing. They discovered that Sherlunker 583 caught out of Lake No Idea How to Pronounce it. It was a sixth generation granddaughter of Sherlunker number nine caught in 1988 of a completely different reservoir. Just imagine if California had been doing this with some of their fish. Dottie's genetics live on, but it's confined to one singular reservoir. They could have crossbred her with the descendants of other giant California bass and then stocked them all over San Diego. But now she's dead and gone. It's been 18 years since the last 